Hey, if you're bored with MIUI and want to try something new on your device, then this FlyMOS 9 is might be something different choice for you. It's not good for daily driver, of course. It has some little bit of bugs for you, but things if you want to give it a try, something new on your device, just for just for some fun purpose or something new, you can give it a try. But it's a normal thing. It has almost everything available, Play Store or whatever you need. The calling etc. seems to be working. Yes, I just uh, just I mentioned that it includes some little bit of bugs for you, and the bugs which I got some weird one, some expected one, but yes it's just up to you if this is your primary device i will not recommend you installing this but if this is your primary is this, this is not your primary device or even if you just want to try out something new for one hour two hour or some hours or if you don't use this device as your primary device much you can give it a try if we move on to the settings options you can see it's almost like if i move on to the system option of course need to agree mizu mizu if you know about this brand this is what we have flymos 9 version which i'm using right now flymos 8 i made a video some time which means a lot of time ago then it was based on android 10 maybe it's based on android 11 right now and looks quite a quite interesting one with the new quick settings panel the quick settings look good other things are kind of same battery etc whatever you want to check it out this is about my device what we have based on android 11 let's just talk about some other things which we have with august 2021 security patch moving on to some other things so about the settings etc the features which we have for example the display display settings for light mode dark mode that option is available here for you status bar related customizations are also present show network speed show voltage etc the features which you get in flymos 9 are already present in this one things are pretty much same and exciting one the ui seems to be different one if you compare it with ming ui not actually properly different that's also in chinese this is also in but this one looks better you can see system appearance we can customize the layout rest screen lock and launcher themes wallpapers and fonts notification lights a lot more things you can customize a good option to do so we have the security related things for example let me show you by moving into this fingerprint section if you're able to see fingerprint is working fine so yes if you are looking for that security options fingerprint is working fine pin lock is working fine at starting point i got some little bit of issues but that was okay now everything is done but still it includes some bugs a lot of bugs which i will mention in the video description or that website so make sure to check out that because i can't explain all those bugs here but there are bugs and i will mention those for sure other things even i got some other things like the apps were not installing but if i use play store the things were working fine so yes this is also one things to keep in mind but some things let me show you by moving into the into some other things here for example you can see tried uh, tried installing some apps on the google play store working fine but uh, by installing the apk these were not working if i try and calling 198 or wherever i want to the calling etc was not having any kind of issues even i was able to receive calls i was able to do calls so yes no issues in calling which is also one of the major things to keep in mind so these things are working that's okay else things are kind of same as i previously mentioned it might contain bugs so yes if this is your primary device i will not recommend you installing this but if you still want to give it a try link is in the description installation is same like other custom rooms of course you can install firmware if you want if you're facing this network issues you can install firmware all the written instructions are already available make sure to check out that before installing this build on your device and i will recommend you using orange fox custom recovery as always this is all from today's short a simple video if you like this video don't forget to like and share this i will see you in the next video goodbye Like I'm floating through the air